Hi everyone, Brian from Black Ops Toys coming at you today with a very special, not an unboxing, but what am I doing? I'm showing you something new that you're probably going to want. This is the new Easy and Simple Special Mission Unit, or SMU, uh, Part 10, Rec Element Sniper. So this is the North American exclusive. This is limited to about 200 units worldwide, and it's for pre-order on our website. Check link below. So I just wanted to kind of go through this guy with you and show you what's what and kind of tell you about how cool he is. So 200 units worldwide. Let's take a look. So this is a prototype, okay? So this was uh, essentially put together, photographed, and then sent to us, uh, built, which is really nice. I don't have to do all the work, woo! All right, first off, awesome figure. So let's kind of go walk you through what this guy has on him and what he comes with. Um, let's just start at the bottom and go with these shoes. Solomon. Really nice. They're getting a lot more crisp as far as detail goes. Paint job's excellent. Uh, we move up. Holster. Uh, this is a SIG. Let's kind of go through this real quick. We've seen this before. Fantastic gun. So extended magazine. You can see the round on top there, right? Then you can rack it. You can actually see the magazine, the round in there. And then this actually does move. The hammer. Hammer time. So looks like you have a weathered Kydex holster, which is nice. Um, just picking them up a little bit. Wristbands. Wristbands, great idea. So simple, but nobody does them. Wristbands are awesome. You know why? Because it covers joints. And joints are what make these guys look not so real. Um, so really good job. Love the wristbands. Excited to actually have a ton of those. <laughs> uh, we noticed AOR1 pants, desert, um, minus the knee pads. So these have uh, these pants you can actually have buy inserts or caps that are knee pads that would slide in there. This guy is not wearing them. You don't need to wear them. So moving around, you can see fantastic job on the actual camo itself. So just like all the other easy and simple figures, spot on. Uh, looks like he has a plate carrier with pack. He's got two radios, so dual radio, radio one, radio two. He's got two headsets, headset one, headset two. Um, he's got these guys. I don't know what those are called. If you do, let me know. Uh, five, five, six, triple cell mag pouch. We have pistol magazine pouch. We have a saw ammo pouch or a dump pouch, or you can use it for whatever you want. Uh, grenade pouch. We do have a smoke grenade pouch. So lots of pouches, lots of kit. Hidden underneath here is a little knife. Be careful, it's sharp. Helmet in AOR1. You can see that it's kind of missing the ears. Um, they make helmets this way so that you can fit types of headsets underneath and not have the helmet crushed down on it. So. Very, very cool. Great figure. I'm excited to be carrying it. Again, North American exclusive, 200 units worldwide. I like bacon. So, AOR1 hat, this is gonna be awesome. This is a, a new design, it looks like, by Easy and Simple. I think they redid the hats. So, fantastic. This actually fits really well. I put it on a couple other figures. Um, and it does have the patch panels, which is nice. So you can kind of decorate how you want. Uh, let's get to the meat. The meat of the stuff. So we have two rifles. This guy right here is a 5.56 custom 5.56 rec rifle or seal recon rifle um, in 5.56. So we have foregrip, peck, suppressor, spring loaded bipod, removable magazine, removable buttstock. We have long range or medium range, and then we have a red dot on top. Bolt does move. Crisp detail. I tell you, Easy and Simple is known for their weapons. Uh, they did a lot of our MSC weapons and they are as realistic as you can get in 1-6 scale. So this guy right here is brand spanking new. So let's kind of go through him real quick. This would be your long range sniper rifle. It's a bolt action. You can see this right here. 
And it's the XM 2010, 2010 meaning year 2010. So bolt, bolt moves up and down. Magazine comes out, metal round on top, so cool, so cool. How cool is it? It's so cool. Long range scope, peck, another bipod, spring loaded, and these feet do pop out. Uh, butt stock, this would fold, and then this right here will move in and out. Cheek rest will go up and down. The reason I'm not doing that is because this is a prototype and we glue things when it's a prototype. <laughs> so other side, this sling is something to be admired. This is a work of art. So this is a leather sling. First leather sling for ENS. They killed it, killed it. So. Awesome rifle, very long now. Once you be able to fold that, then this could go in a backpack, it could be uh, transported much easier. So one other thing, um, that's kind of neat is there's an A, B, and a C. And again, model number is 26030A. A is the North American exclusive. There's a B and there's a C. Now, B is kind of important because B is 10 years later for this guy. So what does that mean? That means that version B is current, modern. Um, this is what we would use today. Version A is 10 years prior. So, uh, version B is essentially this guy 10 years later. And if you look at the head sculpt, head sculpts are the same, but he's grown a beard and he's got a tattoo on his forearm. So that being said, this is one to pick up for sure. Again, limited. I would definitely pre-order now. Uh, great price for pre-order. And this should be released August, September timeframe, I'm thinking. And uh, if you like this video, make sure that you smash that subscribe button and ring that bell to be notified of new content like this guy.